laagan, ako si Kalagan Fritz at ito ang laagan sa Subo. Don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel at laagan sa Subo and click the bell button for notification. Like our official Facebook page at laagan sa Subo. It's another pageant episode and another Cebuana queen na naman ang machichikahan natin sa araw na to. Help me welcome Miss Cebu 2023, candidate number 9, we have Miss Shari C.C. Bacalso. Hi! Hello! How are you? Well, I'm very good. I'm very excited to be here. Oh, thank you for guesting here at Lagan sa Subo. Yes. If I may ask, how is the competition so far? Well, it's been very fruitful and to mm. be with girls who have a lot of pageant experience, it's an honor to be around them and it's very empowering. Yes, you know, talaga nung um one of the exciting part, no, um, meeting your sisters, yes. Diba? Yes. Okay. Most especially that it's my very first pageant. Oh. Yes, and to be around girls with this much experience, it's very exciting. First pageant yes. and Miss Cebu again. Yes. Why not? All right. Now here at Lagan sa Cebu, we have yes. these segments. The first segment that we have is the boiling question. But the question is, are you ready? I'm very ready. Good. Now there are boiling questions here. I want you to pick one first and give it to me. Go okay. ahead. All right. Okay. Your first boiling question is, what is your advocacy and how will Miss Cebu organization will help you with this? Yes. So I advocate against domestic and sexual abuse. Oh. Now that I am a finalist for Miss Cebu 2023, I can use the inevitability of becoming a point of discussion into good use. Through this platform, I can become a voice and an ear for those with experiences of domestic and sexual abuse. Also with this opportunity, I can create awareness among Cebuanos about the long-term effects of these experiences and how prevalent it is to this day. Because bringing it up to authorities is one thing, but surviving with this experience is another. And also because of Miss Cebu, I am here sitting with you today talking about my platform, which I'm very grateful for. Yes, no. And yes, naman, in order for you to be your, the voice for those mga young ladies, also you, women, for those who are young ladies or women who are voiceless. Yes. Okay. Now, pick your next boiling question. Okay. All right. Okay. Your next boiling question is, what is the strength of your generation to survive this tribe that challenges today? Well, the strength of our generation mm -hmm. would be the privilege of having access to information. Mm -hmm. In order to strive and thrive in the face of adversity, I think we have to stay well informed. Mm -hmm. Because having access to internet, not only does it give us information about how to tackle these challenges, but it can also be a tool to find entertainment and motivation because facing adversity may, may be out of our control, but the strength of having knowledge can really help us tackle and cope with this experience. Yes, naman. Kasi yung generation ngayon more into tech yun na eh. Yes. Diba? One click na lang, the whole world will know already. Yes, and the it can change every aspect of your life. Absolutely correct. Okay, pick your next boiling question. Here it is. All right. Oh, this is interesting. Your next boiling question is, how will you bridge Cebu to the world well as a Cebuana living in a digital era I think we can use social media to our advantage through this we can create relevant content about our beautiful city and post it on multiple social media platforms as a marketing strategy even by posting tourist destinations by that can capture the attention of the global market can create a huge impact to the tourism of our city even by we can collaborate with foreign influencers that can help boost the relevance of our city internationally. Just like what you do here in Lagan yes. sa Subbu, <laughs> by simply showing the beauty of our city in the international market or through online, we can bridge Cebu City to the world. Absolutely correct, Naman. I would agree with that. Because I'm showing to the world how beauty Cebu is, and we are also yes. showing to the world how Cebuana beautiful. Yes. Diba? Okay, pick your last but not the least boiling question. Okay. Here it is. All right, and it's getting more interesting. 
Okay. If I am a tourist, yes. what place in Cebu will you recommend and why? Well, as a Lumad Zugboanon, mm -hmm. I've been to a lot of places in Cebu City, including tourist destination. If you are a tourist, I would highly recommend two locations. The first one would be the CC Lex, or what we call as the Cebu Cordova Link Expressway, which showcases the diversity of Cebu when it comes to the scenery. This exhibits the highlands, the ocean, and most importantly, the city, which showcases the beauty of Cebu in just the scenery. The second location would be Il Corso, mm -hmm. which is a gastronomic destination that can allow tourists like you to get to know the diverse culinary culture of Cebu City, which in fact is just a quick trip from the Sicilex. Absolutely, it's just very near. Yeah, it's very near. And yes, I would agree. Sicilex talaga. Once you cross the bridge of the Sicilex, makita mo talaga yeah. the beautiful city of Cebu. Yeah, it's uh, very captivating. Absolutely. All right, makalaga no. The questions are getting more interesting, and the answers of our Miss Cebu today is very well said. But before we proceed with our next segment, I would like to thank first the Center Suite. Thank you very much for the accommodation. And I would like to personally thank Team Flora Dermatologica for always making me fresh because I am Team Flora Touch. Now let's lighten up, let's loosen up because yes. our next segment is the Fast Talk. Okay. Are you ready? I am ready. Perfect. Okay, Fast Talk. Hot or cold? Hot. Oh, hindi marte ka ba? Hindi. Oh, hindi madli ka bang ma in love? Oh. How many times you take a bath? Twice. No cell phone or internet? No internet. One piece or two piece when it comes to pageant? One piece. Walang tulog, walang kain? Walang tulog. Favorite pastime? Watching Netflix. Island life or city life? Island life. Beauty or brain? Brain. Travel or books? Travel. Sweet or spicy? Spicy. YouTube or Netflix? Netflix. Fruits or vegetables? Vegetables. Hashtag ng buhay mo. Hashtag catalyst of change and progress. Oh, amazing. All right, can you please invite our Lagan Sisu viewers where yes. we can follow you, your social media platform, and how we can support you for the upcoming Miss Cebu 2023. Go yes. ahead. You can add me on Facebook. It's Sherry Stacy Bacalso. And you can follow me on my Instagram at Sherry Bacalso. And I would like to invite everyone on January 11, 2023 at the Grand Pacific Ballroom at Waterfront Casino and Hotels for our Coronation Night for Miss Cebu 2023. All right, Makalagan, once again, our Miss Cebu 2023 candidate number nine, we have Miss Shari Stacy Bacalso. Yes. Thank you so much for thank guesting here much. at Lagan Cebu. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. Oh, thank you again. And also, congratulations for being part of Miss Cebu 2023 and good luck. Thank you. You're Thank welcome. you very much. And also, don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel at Lagan sa Subu and click the bell button for notification. Like our official Facebook page at Lagan sa Subu. You may also follow me on my TikTok account, Instagram, and Facebook at Fritz Gerald Alcaraz. Once again, ako si Kalagan Fritz nagsasabi, stay safe, be a responsible Kalagan, and this is Lagan sa Subu. Subu.